I tried it on for the first time yesterday and I instantly liked it. So pretty. Half sprays, maybe a little bit less. Oh my goodness. Oh, it smells really good already. My goodness, I can just imagine the dry down already. Oh. really good um oh it smells so good <laughs> it smells incredible um even the very beginning i've read a lot of reviews on chalimar one of the things that i found very interesting is how beautifully people spoke of chalimar i think everything i read about it just about everything was true, but I, I couldn't imagine what it smelled like. I thought it would be more, uh, I thought it would be spicier. And I do like spiciness in perfume, um, but I'm glad that Shalimar isn't. I'm glad that Shalimar smells the way it smells. And scentsy, I thought maybe, but what I experienced the first time when I sprayed it was the citrus, but just very quickly. And then as I would smell it, it's like every time I smell it, I it almost feels like I smell something different. Um, then I smelled a flower very clearly. I'm not sure what flower, but it was a flower. And then I smelled another flower and leather. I can smell the leather in it. Um, I remember one review I read described the smell of vinyl and and yes I think there is a smell of vinyl like leather and vinyl both uh, one of the smells one of the smells the vinyl smell is pleasant I think there is a mixture of the vanilla in there. There's a mixture of different ingredients that are bringing, that are creating that, uh, I think. And it reminds me of when I was a child having these baby dolls and they had like soft torsos, like stuffed, you know, cotton and, and stuffed torsos and little plastic legs, arms and a head. And I remember smelling the heads of those um, baby doll toys, um, dolls, smelling the heads had this good smell. And they were little plastic heads, and the smell of the head was pleasant. And I don't know if that was intentional or not by the toy maker, um, or I don't know, but it, it had a good smell. And another um, smell was erasers, novelty erasers as a child and thinking in elementary school, not regular erasers from regular pencil, but um, novelty erasers that had, you know, stripes and different colors and shaped as different things. I remember some of those used to smell good. And again, I don't know if that was intentional or if it's just the material that smelled like that, I don't know. But I remember it smelled good, it had a good smell. So that eraser smell in the baby doll head, there's a little bit of that in Shalimar. At least that's what I relate it to. There's also a, a little bit of either clove or anise or both, but it's just the tiniest little bit. And I smelled it just slightly at maybe once, I, I smelled it maybe twice. It seems like every time I, I smell the perfume, it smells different, a little different. Once it, it dried down and it combined with me and um, what would be left after several hours, I just, it's so nice. It's this beautiful powdery, but not powdery, um, not like because it's not powder it's like a powdery comforting i guess it's vanilla 
but almost sweet but not sweet. It's like this pleasant, soft, comforting, powdery type smell. And it's so beautiful. Shalimar is animalic. It does have, it contains civet. I think this civet is, I'm pretty sure it's artificially produced now for ethical reasons, which I think is good. And um, so it does have an animalic um, component there. And today, this is the second day where I sprayed it a couple hours ago um, after I got home from work. And, um, and I really started to be able to smell that animalic, um, I believe it's the civet. And I love the smell of animals. I think animals smell great. Like a petting zoo or just pets. Like I think animals smell really good. There's something about that. And so it does have that. Um, um, but after several hours, what I experienced was just a very calm, gentle, comforting smell. Right now, right now I it's starting to, I still smell some of the civet. I smell that powdery gentleness coming through. Um, the citrus I just smell at the beginning and, and some of the florals at the beginning. And then it turns into other smells. Shalimar I can see as a study with lots of books and a fireplace going and comfortable leather furniture, leather and wooden furniture and a cozy sweater and a blanket and a cat and a warm hot chocolate or warm tea and the piano on. That's what I would describe Shalimar as being. Um, I would use words to describe Shalimar as grand. Um, I heard another reviewer use the word masterpiece. I would say masterpiece. Um, regal. Going through time, I feel like I can smell into the past. Comforting. But there is a side of Shalimar like when it's first sprayed in the first few hours where it can also be like adventure, um, like a road trip in a classic car, a convertible with white leather interior and a pastel exterior sunglasses and the sun is setting and the temperature is perfect it's something to wear to a ball to the ballet i don't think i could wear it to work like i wouldn't be able to spray it on me and go to work because all those hours in the beginning it's it's not um i almost want to say it's not appropriate there's it's, there's a lot going on in Shalimar. Um, there are many different smells in Shalimar. Like that animal smell, that leather smell, the just barely little bit of spiciness that I think might be clove and or anise. So it's my second day. And it smells so so good every time I smell it it's like there's something different I actually smell a little bit of the citrus now which I usually was smelling in the very beginning was the one of the first things I would sense um, but I can smell it now and I smell the leather and I smell that powderiness I smell that vanilla I think it's vanilla um, I did order several 
samples of other perfumes by Guerlain, and I did that before Shalimar arrived. So I'll be getting those. It'll be interesting to see other creations by Guerlain. But this, this perfume has become a part of my life, and this is day two experiencing Shalimar, and it has become a part of my life because I like it that much. I can see how people might not like it, like the way people don't like fruitcake. They'd rather just have like a plain cupcake, which is fine. I can see how a man could wear it um, easily. A man could wear this. With Shalimar, Shalimar is strong. One spray is strong. And um, it's there's all these different scents that are coming through, all these different notes that are coming through. And it's quite intense for the first few hours. Um, but I would be compelled to want to spray it twice, once on my neck and once on my arm so that I can, because I like it that much. I'm excited to try more of Guerlain and um, I had been wanting to try this for some time and I just didn't get around to getting it but I'm so glad I did. always want to have a bottle of it. I will be wearing it a lot at home and wearing it out but carefully. <laughs> Maybe the later stage of of the you know dry down I could wear out freshly sprayed um, would be quite daring I think to wear out 